So, we're taping this episode during National Park Week, and Bridget and I just couldn't help but take a moment to share our love for America's great outdoors. So, with that said, it's time for Know Your National Parks. <laughs> it's exciting stuff. The Katmai National Park in southern Alaska is home to breathtaking views of a frozen tundra. It's also home to 2,000 brown bears that won't think twice about tearing you up like a bag of confetti. <laughs> Afraid it's too cold for you? Don't worry, there's also six active volcanoes on site. It's a perfect combination of hot and cold, which is why Cat May is referred to as the Katy Perry of national parks. <laughs> Moving on, the Mammoth Cave of Central Kentucky begs the question, wouldn't it be great to experience government-sanctioned claustrophobia? <laughs> Once you enter the 400-mile underground maze, you'll start to think, are the walls closing in? Didn't I just walk past that cluster of rocks? Is this national park seriously just a big cave? <laughs> You'll question all of this and more as you curl into the beetle position crying for a tour guide at Mammoth Cave. <laughs> Redwood National Park is the place to visit if you're a fan of stunning coastal rainforests. It's also the place to visit if you're a fan of lurking through thick eerie fog like the first creatures crawling out of the primordial ooze. With giant old redwoods scattered throughout, you can't help but wonder. A tree falls in the forest and no one is around to help you. Does it still crack your skull open like a pinata? The answer is, of course, yes. <laughs> Located on the, southern, the sunny Southern California, Joshua Tree National Park is the United States tribute to the U2 album of the same name. <laughs> Bridget, that's not what that park is. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and finally, spend your summer soaking up the sun at Grand Canyon National Park. As one stares out at the over one million acres of beautiful, desolate land, you can't help but think about the insignif insignificance of life itself. But you're not alone. No. You're surrounded by the bones of the forgotten laid, a long time, laid along the bottom of the North Rim. Their flesh is decayed, but their story remains. You can hear their rattling, seeking forgiveness from a vindictive God, but their pleas go unheard. And don't forget to check out all the great bicycle trails, too. <laughs> That's everything you need to know about America's National Parks. Get out there, explore, and don't suffer a tragic death.